Hi friends! This is Dainty Tank. Thank you for joining me. Welcome back to Life is Strange. True Colors. This is part three of our series. You can put Tyro in the upper right card area and see the rest of them. And we're going straight back into it. So last we left off, we actually got to see a little bit of uh, Alex's powers and woo! <laughs> she channels absolutely the emotions of another. So if they come in an uh, angry hothead, She's going to beat them silly and absolutely just go the heck off. So proud of her. <laughs> but that's got to be really rough to manage when you don't want to be violent towards others. So the empathy is complicated on this sense. I can really feel for that. So jumping straight back into it, we were going to go downstairs, say hi to Gabe and apologize. So, let's do that. And the cute swirling colors, which I know now is like the emotions and it looks like a vinyl record. And then the little icon for saving is a little vinyl record. I should record. go downstairs and set things right with Gabe. Yeah. I also have my fan on. I'm sorry about the noise. It's because of the fact that anytime I'm playing Life is Strange, it about kills my hardware. So, forgive me on that. I don't think there's anything else that we're going to look at up here besides, you know, there's a sad crack. I know I kicked the drywall crack when I see one. Anything I can do with that? Nope. Yep, we're just going to go downstairs. And that's okay. We might have kicked the crap out of Riley's boyfriend. Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. <clears throat> huh. <laughs> so, it hurts when you breathe? Alex, you made it. Charlotte, right? Put some ice on. I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Dad, I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine. Hmm. I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing. Now you just go with him. <sighs> Alex, I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Well, there goes my bartender and my backup bartender. Oh, no. Cool they live above bar though. I love that. It's a falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So what's it doing today? Rising, falling. Rising for sure. Rising. For sure. First day of my new life. Oh, good. I'm glad Max stupidity didn't ruin everything. Hmm. The colors on her hair are amazingly like this. I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. He's a great kid. I know literally nothing about kids, but he seems like one of the good ones. I appreciate that. He's my favorite person. You're a good human. By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. I hope you won't be mad at me. You did the right thing. Cool. Beef pie special. Watch the gravy. <laughs> Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my watch. Hmm. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival and they have to be done tonight. Sorry I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah, same. Bye, thanks for supper. Yep. This is a really awesome bar. Ooh, billiards, yes. 
I always love playing billiards at a gay bar. Oh, Steph! Yes! Gotta to talk to my favorite queer So I'm short staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years' experience as a server? Uh. Go with Gabe's story. Come clean. Um, Gabe's story is nice. Probably come clean, though. Gabe's full of shit. I've never worked in a restaurant before. Never stops that one. But I would love the work if experience isn't an issue. Want to give it a try? It's not too busy right now, and we keep it informal around here. Okay. Thanks. All right. So we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Oh my God, Ducky. Steph over here. Uh, there's a table in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right? Got it. It's really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. Oh, man. Guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Tab. Check on Ducky and Diane. Uh, Diane as in Diane Jacobs, the mining person, and Ducky, the person who glued a taxidermied animal to himself. That sounds right. <laughs> Clear your table. Check on Steph. In the service. I should check on that table. I know. That's why we're... Can I get you to anything? Miss Chen, here at last to relieve our suspense. Oh, you are Hi. dressed. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, <laughs> ducky to friends, ducky former to friends. entrepreneur, now retired. <laughs> and this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that- uh, That we all knew you were coming, yes. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. That sounds right. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from DC six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? Kind of perfect. If we're starting a new life, quiet, smaller pe amount of people, and uh, I have an emotional superpower. Kind of perfect. I didn't really know what to expect, but it's... Kind of perfect. <laughs> it feels like a home. I know, I know. I really thought I would hate it. Then I saw the mountains, met some people, and now I'm never leaving. Woo! Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, too. Ah. Uh. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. My dad was in the service. Was he? New dialogue unlocked. Probably with Jed. Wow. Tetanus anyone? I <laughs> hope Brian's got better supplies. Hey, Jed. Yeah. I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. Uh, burger with mushrooms. One burger with mushrooms. Uh huh. And pie special with fries. One pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. 
Serves him right if you ask me, but feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Okay. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. Might have some idea. He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. He's usually there must here. Be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Okay. Oh, Typhon's not a bad company. Once you get used to how they operate. Oh, is that really Ryan? <laughs> right. Yeah, that's what people keep telling me. Oh, is that really Oop. Ryan? Takes a minute to learn the ropes, though. Huh? New miner? Yeah, I guess. The way they do things is just so... I don't know. <laughs> Idiosyncratic. Oh. I got written up for leaving my phone on. It wasn't even on me. But I guess it started firing Starting over from scratch like this? Duty. Fucking terrifying yeah, is what it is. You're stuff. telling me. It's a security concern. Hmm. I mean, sure, but it's not. Starting like over from scratch like CIA this? Or whatever. Fucking terrifying is what it is. Mountains for a living. My extensive wilderness map reading knowledge <laughs> tells me that there is a whole lot of wilderness around here. Yeah. For rattlesnake bites, see Ryan. For rattlesnake shots, see Judd. <laughs> Backcountry skiing by permit only. Trail maps available by the ranger station. It's just nothing. Look. All right. Town of Haven Springs counts a vote notice. An official council meeting will be held May twenty sixth to decide one measure. This measure proposes selling property of no more than 20 acres to Tyson Typhon Mining for use in an open pine a pipe open pit mine. Both the sale profit and subsequent property taxes will be added to the overall budget of Haven Springs to be divided and spent through standard procedure. More information will be available at town hall to talk to a council member if you have any questions or concerns. Yep. <laughs> Small town. I hear you, kid. I've been jumping through Typhon's hoops since Noah built Only 45 bucks for the chance to get mauled by a bear. <laughs> oh, fishing in a big game, hunting. Limited license applications due a couple days ago. Uh, resident license fees have changed. Annual fishing license, 25. Deer, elk, bear. You could have a bear, mountain lion, bighorn sheep. Youth licenses now available. <laughs> All right, see Ryan. God is. But things are the way they. I have. That looks radioactive. It does. That's the girl from the record store, Steph. Yeah. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey, just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though, if you want to chat. Hmm. Who are you sitting with? So are you um here with somebody? Or... That's Ryan's stuff. Apparently he ditched me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Luke and family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? No. It was a big deal. Back when he was a minor, he saved... I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. Sorry, Jed. But... He doesn't like to brag, but there's stuff about it all over the place if you look. Interesting. What are you working on? Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no, it's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? Yeah. 
Of course. Sure. Live action role play, right? Fantasy fighting in real life? Yep. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> God, you're Would so you cool. Would you ever want to join us sometime? Uh, <laughs> doesn't, you don't have to be an actor. That's not the thing. It's, it's literally just, you can go and be you and just be you in a nerdy, absolute fantasy spins or completely different. Someone new. It, you don't have to be an actor. You just have to try and it's fun. I am a big proponent for D&D and LARPs. Yes. <laughs> sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. Is that your shot? Is that your shot? What is that? Absence? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. <laughs> no one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong. You have to take the shot. Oh. Ryan and I are going to play. You want to take his place? You're on. Dude, you're on. <laughs> yes. So I'll pick a song. You have five yes or no questions before you have to guess it. Okay. Oh, okay. Is this going to be real? Like, Steph grew well. Like, honestly, she's living her best life in Colorado. Got one. Jukebox is all yours. So, what do you want to ask me? Hmm. I should flip through these and see what might be good to ask. Ooh. Think of the children song missing. Cover our questions. Picture of an Is animal. Is there an animal on the cover art? Uh, no. No animals. Ugh, too bad. Some of these are really cute. I know, right? <sighs> cover art. People? Are there people on the cover? No. Yes, yeah, so no. That's not fair. Okay. Let's go back then. Hold on. So, this is one people song missing. Think of the children is one available. That's not available. 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 Fuckadelics. Husky and wigs. Shit gets real. Okay. Nope. 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 Ooh. I didn't mean that. Hold on. There are no animals on the cover. Has the band Is name. the band name on the cover? Yep. You've got two questions left. Okay. So band name is on the cover. So that means ampersand is one. That's not one. Fuck Alex is one. That's out. So it's uh, the ampersand or fuck Alex. Band name. 
has a symbol. Would that rule out either of my two? Uh, that has a symbol. Ampersand has... Ah. Uh, one word. Is the band name only one word? It is more than one word. That's the fuck, hmm. Alex. Last question. Yeah, all right, I know. All right, personal questions. Long time fan. Why do you like it? Why do you like this song? So, I guess we're breaking the yes or no questions only rule. Can you handle it? So, why do I like this song? The lyrics crack me up. Even the title's pretty goofy. Reminds me of fun times, I guess. Yup. Goofy it's... title, you say? Hmm. That's your five. Ready to guess? Yeah. Let me look through one last time. It's Here's kiss up and shut me. It's not a one word band name. No animals on the cover. No people on the cover. The band name is on the cover. The title's kind of goofy. Think that's enough to figure it out? We'll see. <laughs> Fuck. Nice one. Guess I'm drinking? <laughs> hmm. You can do it. <laughs> ah, Steph. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cute. Oh. <laughs> hey, thanks for playing. I'm really glad we did. Me too. I should get back to work. Okay. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's sure, prized whiskey. Yeah, but I had, like, a lot of fun there. Really, I, I like my job. Okay. There you have it. Liar. Oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. <laughs> Radical acceptance. Finding gratitude in the midst of chaos. New. Okay. This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. Ah. Uh. What? Damn. I wonder if the bullet's still in there. <laughs> Your Jack Henry shot at William Porter over four acres and paid for his life. 1883. Rest in peace, mister. That's a high shot. How tall was he? Guess these were for mining. Yeah, it's blasting caps. Maybe I'll see a circus one day. Once I'm better with crowds. You have a lot to do, but that's okay. Unusually personable staff. Nicely done, big bro. Okay. Boulder Weekend, food and wine. All right. Uh, standard pub fare, service serviceably prepared with occasional standout service specials, is elevated by unusually personable staff, exceptional service, and quirky patrons, creating a unique, uplifting experience. Well worth the drive. All right. Get it. Shit. Now Mac's scared. At least he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. Hmm. Plack. Yeesh. Glad I'm not a 19th century miner. Attack board used in Tiller Mine around 1880. Every miner removed his check tag as he entered the mine and replaced it on the board when he was had safely exited. Okay. Ah, that's the tag board. 
Do I get to read the tag board? Boop. Haven seems pretty proud of its mining history. Jed asked me to clear that off. Holy shit. Can I talk to you real quick? What do you want? What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Mainly you. You're the one who caused it. That is bullshit. And you know it. I was defending Gabe from you. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. But Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? You want me to lie? You're awful. You're just an awful human. You really are a piece of shit. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. So please, help me out. is wrong with you oh my god look at your face no, it's okay don't even what were you thinking where's gabe why do you give a shit because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him i swear this is it you better have a good explanation, or we're done. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! <sighs> About why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. Okay, um, not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. Oh God, were you there too? We are not avoiding further trouble. We're calling Mac out. Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. What happened to Mac's face? I did that. Well, good. It sounds like he deserved it. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Yes. Wait, wait, are you, are we okay? Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we still together? What do you think, you fucking idiot? No. Alex Chen? Uh. Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. Uh, am I under arrest? Are you saying I'm under arrest? <laughs> your face. <laughs> you should see your face. Oh, uh, fuck you, man. <laughs> no, I'm only kidding. Uh, nobody's in trouble here. Right? <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. Y you're a dick. <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe. 
I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? All right. Well, that was eventful. Was there anything else in here? Newsletter. Haven seems pretty serious about this festival. Only two spots left in the bread baking competition. There are only two spots remaining. For this year's spring festival, this year's theme is seeds and nuts. Interesting par uh, participants should call Isabel ASAP. Grand prize winner last year was Peter Groves with a garlic asiago loaf. Oh, that sounds great. Mining sponsors raffle and Caribbean cruise. Wow, they're literally throwing money at this community to shut the fuck up. <laughs> Seven day cruise in the Caribbean. Airfare is included. Prize is donated by Typhon Mining. Raffle proceeds benefit the Haven Springs Firehouse, Haven Springs Historical Preservation Society. Tickets can be purchased ahead of time at the town hall or at the festival. Good! Glad! I actually have quite the uh, history of winning raffles. Coupons for weed? What a time to be alive. Flowers, candies, cooking butter, mm-hmm, 20% off any product. April 2020. And it's just sitting there. I know, I was about to say, this is a good time to be alive right now. <laughs> uh, How mysterious. Hmm. Amelia Rosam Goldstein. On the site, Amelia Goldstein operated a bed and breakfast for nine years, known for its beautiful rooftop garden. She died at the age of 32 of influenza. Though married shortly before her death, the identity of her husband remains a mystery. Because he didn't matter, she did. <laughs> but yeah, I've actually won, I'm not kidding here, a six foot blue bunny. See, Harmon must be Charlotte. This is really cool. Dang, Charlotte, get it. But yeah, I literally won a six foot blue bunny. I am not playing more games. Nope. I would play billiards, though. <laughs> um, I named him Harvey after the invisible blue rabbit from that very old show. All right. Go upstairs, find that bottle, on the couch. Alright, let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Yep. Think you can. It's probably searching in the couch. <laughs> ha! Hey, Muckery Hill Straight Rye Whiskey. Unlike that queer rye whiskey, <laughs> I'm a whiskey fan, so. Get it. And Pike, ugh. Found this upstairs. In Gabe's couch? Really? Must have been a night. Many thanks, Alex. Put in the good word. Well, it's my first day working here, so put in a good word for me, okay? <laughs> She's a go-getter. Like her. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. To Miss Alex Chen, a most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Nice. Where'd that third glass come from? Oh. <sighs> Looks like it's I've crap. Just asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. My dad was in the service. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Not yet. Actually, not yet. There's one more thing. And I will speed walk over there as fast as I can. My dad was in the service. Just checking in. Hey. No, nope. okay. Cool. Making sure. Anything I need of you? 
Hey, Alex. Back to work. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Okay. So it's either have a drink or don't have a drink. Not gonna have a drink with that guy. Speak. Are you done now? Okay, finished. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Hmm. <laughs> well, speak of the devil. Hey. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. I think that's enough for today. I was glad to have you. I can see you're a hard worker. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Time to talk to Gabe. Okay. Yeah, this is a lot of feelings. That was fun, though. Like, the whole game with Steph. Super fun. <laughs> okay, we're gonna... Pause and... Get through these. <laughs> Here we go. Lost dog. Ryan Gold seems like a sweet guy. She's very sweet. Please let me know. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'll keep an eye out. Hope you get some safe. Let me know beforehand if you want to look for her in the woods, okay? I can help. Okay, I will. Nice! Silver jar. First to Charlotte's dispensary. She seems cool. First person finished the lyrics gets 10% off their next silver dra dragon purse. Just love so deep in the pit of my heart. And if you're not 21 yet, this post isn't for you. Fucking fine now. And each day grows more and more. Babe, we've talked about this. Boyfriends are not allowed to participate in giveaways. You know I can't resist the temptations. Okay, new lyric to finish. Don't hesitate cause this world seems cold. Stay young at heart, cause, cause you're never, never old. Earth, wind, and fire. You got it. Show me this post next time you swing by. All right, cool. I think I see a lot more of the jukebox game in my future. <laughs> PSA, don't play a jukebox game with Alex Chen, unless you really like terrible booze. I'm sure you'll develop a taste for it. Have your fun now, but no. Revenge is a bedazzled kiwi schnapps. Shot. Best served cold. <laughs> I've never been more proud. <laughs> Haven has an indie movie theater. Impressive. Oh, awesome. Best living dead movie. Night, day, land, dairy. Marathon of the Dead. Watch them all. Stupid debate. Dawn of the Dead was obviously the best. <laughs> Have you ever seen Survival of the Dead? Nope. Neither has anyone else. I don't think Land of the Dead gets enough credit. Let's face it. None of the sequels live it up to Night of the Living Dead. I agree with Steph. Literally, how dare you? Dear God, what have we done? <laughs> Two hour warning. If you mark Danger Zone, you will be clear clearing out now. Okay. Poster disabled replies. Great. Ducky. Dear Alex. Thank you for... Literally starting an email. Oh my god, it's a text email. Oh, boomer. <laughs> it was very much my pleasure meeting you this evening. I hope you find a welcoming home here in Haven. I look very forward to meet to the next meeting. Sincerely, Reginald McAllister the third. Thank you, Ducky. That's very sweet. <laughs> All right. Boop. It's just beautiful. Beautiful rooftop here. No. Oh, deep bonding time. Hmm. 
Nope. How's your jaw? How's your jaw? Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... Did you re rehearse that move? Did you rehearse that move? No. <laughs> Only in my mind. Uh-huh. <laughs> so, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? <laughs> okay, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. I know, I only hit you once. Now that we're talking about it. Guess I never realized. That I can kick your ass, cause, yeah, you know, I can. That I can kick your ass? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> no, I never realized what your life must have been like. Fair. On your own. Very fair. It was fine. And that's a lie. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Uh huh. Like you've done it before. So, <laughs> I felt a lot. Didn't go to Juvie. Didn't you go to Juvie? I mean, yeah, but like, Juvie doesn't give you as many options or opportunities for fighting than foster care system does, so... And if you're in a, uh, a facility that allows you to fight or has the opportunity for you to fight, you're gonna be, you're gonna be fighting, you're gonna be scrapping for your life. And obviously, from her notes herself, I know of at least two different fights she's been in in which she wrecked someone because she has her powers. Like, as someone who's also been through fights growing up, that's the answer. I fought a lot. Kids in foster care fight a lot. I learned how to defend myself. Well, I defend myself that's well. Me. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. Yes. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? I felt Mac's anger and then I jumped you. Ooh, tell him about your past. Tell him about your power. Ooh, past is interesting because past means like all of my background details but power is relevant now so I'm gonna go with power yes there's something off about me mm-hmm I know what other people are feeling. I can see these auras around them. And if they feel strongly enough, if they're angry or sad or afraid, I feel it too. And then I lose control. Oof. And this has happened for a long time. Like Mac. I felt 
all that anger like it was my own. I think it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. It's more than that. He wasn't just angry at you. He's angry at himself. He thinks he's gonna lose Riley. And he did, by his own actions. Did Riley tell you that? No. I just felt it. Dude, win. Win. No, totally. During our sleepover. Right after braiding each other's hair. <laughs> okay. Okay. sure it's not just, you know? It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds or stress or trauma or whatever. It's real. It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? <laughs> it doesn't work like that. You need more beer. You're feeling like you need a lot more beer. <laughs> That's true most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> I don't expect you to believe me. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. I guess I am. Hmm. Dude, you have superpowers. Yeah. <laughs> More like a super curse. Nah, are you fucking with me? You're fucking with me, right? I'm serious. Did you listen to anything I just said? This is terrible. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... I have no idea what's going on with people half the time. It's beautiful. And Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there. I mean, that's, yeah. That's really special. I will say that you, my... Dear sir, honey sweet Cinnabon, don't need to improve your emotional intelligence. Your emotional intelligence is higher than any male species innately off the ground. Sorry to those who are of the male persuasion. Apologies. Special. Uh, broken? No, special? Special. That's really your take on all this? Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? <laughs> but it doesn't matter what's going on. I'm here for you. Don't forget that. Oh, he's a sweetheart. <laughs> Cheers. Yes. <laughs> So, when were you going to tell me about the guitar? Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. Surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? I love it. I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? Hey, is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. He was, but I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, no. You don't think... Maybe? Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Because they're about to blast. 
Sheesh. Ah, oh, kiddo. There's blasting notices everywhere. And you're even on my block. I saw you on there. So I actually, I'm gonna stop this here. Thank you for letting me talk to you about everything here. We're gonna find out what happened to Ethan after. I know that I keep goading us off, but I think this was fairly conclusive of an episode. We'll figure out what's going on with Ethan and anything related after this next period. You're not gonna have to wait long. I'm posting Fridays and Saturdays so you get two hits of the same true colors every time. Subscribe and come back and come back and hang out with me, you know. Like the button, do the subscribe belly thingies. <laughs> I love you all and I'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>